I'm so upset about that. But they gave me a, a, um, a voucher. Yeah, they gave me a voucher. Probably just back to Dallas right, after the season. But that look made me – actually, I was very mad, bro. I didn't – I didn't have close for like a day and a half there. I was, well, <laughs> this is nasty. I wore the same thing for a day and a half. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> Good afternoon. How y'all doing? Shane, you guys have obviously a high standard defensively. When you have a, a game probably not up to that standard, was it tough to be on the bye because you don't get a chance to go right back out on the field and, and get it back? Or was it good to kind of take a week off to kind of get refreshed and look at what you're doing and all that? Uh, I would say it was good just for us to be able to just like, yeah, we, of course, we talked about it, but it's, you know, it's over with. Uh, we expect better. We have higher expectations of ourselves as each person uh, individually and as a team. And at that point, after a couple of days uh, went by, we were just kind of like, all right, it's over with. New, new week, new opportunity. So we're good. It's all right. Time to get back at it. Sean, how are you and your guys rallying around the week this week? Well, I didn't find out Malik, uh, Malik's incident until maybe like, the night of, or the night before we got back. So, I mean, he's, he'll be all right. Uh, things happen. Um, we're just happy he's safe, healthy. Well, sort of healthy. Happy he's safe and back here with us. And he'll be all right. A couple of weeks, he'll be back. He'll be fine. It was a little pea shooter. He'll be all right. Sean, do you feel like uh, a vocal leader out there? Do you feel like you need to lift everybody up with, you know, demonstrative? <clears throat> you know uh, I would say, I mean, I'm trying my best to be the best player in person I can be for our team and I'm sure all of us are even our, um, a lot of our older guys so I think we, if our older guys step up and we we by example we'll come around as a defense as a whole and I think we're not far from that we just got to get it back uh, right on track the way we know uh, the Ravens can play. Deshaun you're, you're playing another team this week that throws underneath a lot um, as you think about the most important things you guys can do to keep those short passes from turning into big plays like they have a few times this season, what, what, what are they? What's, what are the... It's technique and uh, execution. We just got to continue working on our technique and execution. That starts in practice, starting today. So uh, we just got to go out there and do, do what we need to do. It's not always about X's and O's. It's about players and us doing our job. And I think we, we're going to get it done. Um, we just got stable guys to the ground. That's been our biggest thing right now, stabling guys to the ground. Hey, Deshaun, uh, last week, uh, Trev Bateman shared with us that you being his right hand in terms of uh, helping his injury. Can you share those thoughts with, with us? Uh, I mean, I've been through a lot in my career. So I just kind of told um, the young boy, he, he got here. And the first couple of days, I could see his talent. I could see the way he moved. I was like, he, he can be something out here. So when he went down, I was kind of like, dang, you know what I'm saying? But all, all I could do was tell him, hey, it's, it's early, bro. Like, you're young. So it's, you got to take one day at a time. And it's a long season. So as long as you keep working, keep working your butt off to get back, don't worry about it. We're we going to welcome you with open arms. Just do what you got to do to get back healthy. And I think he's finally done that. And I think he's going to progress throughout the season. Sean, what are you seeing from Marlon and, and the way that, I don't want if you want to call it struggles or whatever, I, maybe he's not playing where he wants to be. But what are you seeing as one of his peers in the locker room? I mean, Marlon's my dude. I mean, Marlon is always going to be all for Marlon. And, uh, as a whole, it was not just Marlon. We take that uh, into account of everybody in the secondary. We got to play better as a whole together. And when we do that, we're going to be great. I mean, everybody has a bad day. You got to go out there and make up for it by playing with, with each other as brothers. So he's going to be all right. Marlon is the best corner in the NFL. He's going to continue to show y'all that. Y'all going to see. We're good. All right. God bless. Thank you so much.